Hi, this is Chris Cranston here from Petability, and I'm with my friend Becca, who is a very dog-like cat. I was planning to demonstrate some passive re range of motion with him because I've done it in the past and I know he can tolerate it. But I'm rushing out to an appointment, and as we've said on our podcast, you never want to be stressed or rushed when you're doing passive range of motion. So make sure that you're in a comfortable, quiet place and that your cat is relaxed because they feel your vibes. Now, he is purring, he settled down here. Notice I'm doing some stroking and massage to get him to, to relax and he's really digging that. Now, I'm gonna just move in a little bit. I'm not gonna ask him to lay on his side, but I can move his paw, doing flexion and extension at his wrist. I'm now moving up to his elbow, straightening his extension. Bending his flexion. And then how about a nice shoulder extension there? Cats are amazing creatures. So they are very, very flexible as, as we know. But they also get stiff and sore as they age. Beckham here is about 10. So I think he thinks this feels pretty good.